Okay, I'm going to give you a quick overview on system restore and safe mode, giving you an idea of what they can be used for. If you're already familiar with these tools, please skip forward to 1 minute 30. Okay, I'm going to give you a quick run through the details of safe mode. Safe mode is a troubleshooting option for Windows. It starts your computer in a limited state. Only basic files and drivers necessary to run Windows are started. It eliminates the default settings and basic dr device drivers as possible causes of problems. It's an excellent troubleshooting tool. System Restore. System Restore helps you restore your computer system files to an earlier point in time. It's a way to undo system changes to your computer without affecting your personal files such as emails, documents or photos. Sometimes the installation of a program or driver can cause unexpected an unexpected change to your computer or cause Windows to behave unpredictably. Usually uninstalling the program or driver corrects the problem. If this doesn't fix the problem, you can try restoring your computer system to an earlier date when everything worked correctly. The computer automatically creates system restore points. These restore points contain information about registry settings and other system information that Windows uses. System Restore is not intended for backing up personal files, so it cannot help recover a personal file that's been deleted or damaged. To get into safe mode, you need to reboot your computer. Okay, as soon as your window starts to boot, get on the F8 key every second and you should see this advanced boot options menu appear. Okay, from advanced boot, use your keyboard arrow keys that using the down key to go down and select safe mode. Press enter or return on your keyboard and that will start loading windows in safe mode. You'll see this white writing on a background, black background will start to appear. This, this is normal and takes a, a minute or two to run through. Okay, that's Windows has, has now booted in safe mode. You can see in the in the corners of the screen that it's printed safe mode in, in white writing. So we're gonna go ahead now and kick off the system restore. You can do that by clicking on the start button, going up to all programs, up to accessories, into the system tools folder, and in there you should see system restore. When you open System Restore, you have two options available. There's a recommended restore and there's choose a different restore point. You can check out the date and time of the recommended restore. If that if you think that's far enough back and your problem wasn't present in the computer at that date and time, you can go with the recommended restore. Otherwise, you can do what I'm going to do here. I'm going to choose a different restore point. In here I can see there are three restore points available and uh, you can click this little button down here show more restore points to show more available restore points I'm I'm running a clean virtual machine so it, it's only been running since yesterday so I have no older restore points than than, than these ones and um, on your PC you probably will have a lot more so select the date and time where you had where your computer was working fine and that's the date we're going to restore to. So I'm just going to select this last, this this last one here, for demonstration purposes. I'm going to click next, and then I'll click finish. So we, a warning comes up and says that once system restore cannot has started, it cannot be interrupted. You can undo these system restores later on, but once you have once the restore has started, you have to let it run its course. So I'm going to say yes, and. Windows will reboot automatically itself. So th this will take a few minutes. Most PCs, will, it should be around five or six minutes. It can take longer depending on how, how much stuff is installed on your computer.
and once the Windows has loaded completely you should have a message saying that the system restore has completed successfully that's the, that's the restore done if you have enjoyed this video or have found it useful please click the like button thank you